So yeah, I'm working on a game thing. I'm making a game every week for the month of July. This is game number two. Fifth game I've ever made. It's Gurgugly, or How the Internet Might Kill Us All. I quite like how it turned out. I guess this is the why I made it, because I'm, I, I, I'm not a tutorial guy. Uh, there's there's other people who know a lot more about Unity and are a lot better teachers on that, so I'm not, forget this tutorial thing. I'm a rambling guy. I'm a rambling writer guy. That's that's what you come to me for. Weird writing advice, maybe? I don't know. Write, literally free write. Just write the first thing that comes to mind. Bada boom. Like, just make up words and then polish that into a thing. There you go. That's the that's the trick to writing. That's the, the main trick to writing. The words are all made up anyway. It's all made up. All this is made up. Uh, Skigugly. Why did I make Skigugly the way I did? Uh, a combination of... The limitations in understanding the engine, plus uh, capacity to artistically interface with said limitations. And Skigugly is an approachable game that I am able to make using my current set of skills. And one of those skills happens to be rhyming and dramatic reading. At least I like to think both of those are skills. Uh, those are skills that are they're on display in Skigugly. I uh, play now. Uh, trailer in three, two, one. Nothing in your education or experience could have prepared you for Skigugly. Skigugly is a video game by Malik outside of the tradition of criticism and review. Skigugly is a glimpse into a future best avoided. Skigugly is free until the end of July. Skigugly, or how the internet might kill us all, is free until the end of July. That was the trailer of Sugugly. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you enjoyed playing it. Uh, it's free until the end of July. Then it's gonna be a dollar fifty-five. Uh, back to why I made it. Back to what Sugugly is all about. Uh, if you if you buy, don't buy into our tour theory, if you think the artist is dead, uh, go ahead and kill me by hitting the pause button and closing out the window and thumbsing down. If you don't think the artist is dead, hit me with a thumbs up. Hit me with a subscribe. And keep on listening because I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about the thing that I think about when I think about Skagogly and what it is and how I why I made it the way it is and like basically it, it boils down to the, the the tagline what does or how the internet might kill us after Skagogly mean in the title what what does what does that mean Huge spoilers for Skagugly coming up, but in the world, uh, also known as Skagugaland, under the rule of Skagugly, they manage to perfect a sort of communications technology known as the can on the string. And they were able to affix this at points all across the kingdom, all across the world, all the way to Gullizar and beyond. And they were able to talk with everybody. They were able to talk with everybody, everywhere, all the time. Internet. It, it's the internet. The, the, the cans are a metaphor for the internet. That's very... I, I want to make that plain. I'm going to state it out right here. They're a metaphor for the internet. And I think one of the problems that can come from that functional superpower, that ability to communicate with literally anybody at any time, at any point in the world, is that all of a sudden your attention is resolved outward and pulled and pried as far as it can possibly be pulled and then your attention like you become functionally like blinded to everything that's like nearby and i think this is a problem that day by day uh, society in general is beginning to respect that we're running into and i think it's one of those things that in in this particular work of art is called attention to in such a way that people are invited to think about it, to think about how they're socializing with people in person in the internet age by by basically giving a, giving a warning game, parable, thing. It's like, hey, talk to people more. Communicate. It's, it's uh... I, I, like, the incentive, the urge is there to say it's not complicated, but this stuff is very complicated. Communication is exceptionally complicated. And I don't think most people appreciate exactly how complicated communication can be.
And so, yeah, that's uh, those are sort of the uh, encapsulation of my thoughts of what is going into Skigugly, or how the internet might kill us. Uh, like I said, I'm making making games until the end of July. I'm going to be making three more games each week, and for now, all of the games I will be releasing will be free until the end of July. Then they will cost like a dollar fifty-five each, and they'll be like a five dollar pack for the whole thing. That's the idea I have anyway. So. Uh, Try it for free while you can. Download it while you can. Cherish Skagogly forever and always because Skagogly is the king of Skagogaland. And uh, enjoy, uh, enjoy the rest of the games. Enjoy the previous games. And uh, thank you. Subscribe.